Have you ever dreamed of traveling to distant galaxies in the blink of an eye? Well, that dream may soon become a reality, thanks to a mind-blowing breakthrough made by a team of scientists. For centuries, the speed of light has been considered the ultimate speed limit in the universe, with any object or information unable to travel faster than 299,792,458 meters per second in a vacuum. However, this fundamental constant has now been challenged by a revolutionary discovery that could change the way we think about the limits of travel and communication. Keep watching until the end of this video as we will delve into the details of this groundbreaking discovery and explore its potential impact on the world of physics and beyond. These discoveries may blow your mind. Welcome to Space Infinity. The Current Limitations of Travel at the Speed of Light for centuries, scientists have been fascinated by the concept of traveling at speeds faster than the speed of light. However, the laws of physics have long seemed to prohibit such travel, as the speed of light is considered to be a fundamental physical constant that cannot be surpassed. One of the key laws that limits travel at faster than light speeds is the theory of relativity, which states that as an object approaches the speed of light, its mass increases, and time slows down. This means that as an object approaches the speed of light, it would require an infinite amount of energy to accelerate, making it impossible to reach or surpass the speed of light. In addition, the mass-energy equivalence principle, described by the famous equation E equals mc squared, states that matter can be converted into energy, and vice versa. This means that as an object's speed increases, its mass also increases, making it more difficult to accelerate. These laws present significant challenges for space travel and have long been considered to be insurmountable barriers to travel at faster than light speeds. How can space-time be warped for faster than light travel? Warping space-time is a way to achieve faster than light travel using a concept called a warp drive. The idea is to create a negative energy machine that would allow an object to move faster than the speed of light by spiraling it into a state of negative energy. This would cause the space and time behind the object to expand, while the space and time in front of it contracts. While the concept of negative energy goes against the principles of physics, it is not completely impossible to obtain. Some scientists believe that it may be possible to extract energy from a vacuum to create negative mass and negative gravity. While the feasibility of warp drive is still being debated, researchers in Sweden are working on making the concept a reality by focusing on physical concepts that are already known to humanity rather than relying on negative energy. What's the trick? Dr. Eric Lentz, a physicist at the University of Göttingen in Germany, has discovered a way to travel faster than light by constructing space-time bubbles around a spacecraft using a common type of matter called plasma. These bubbles, known as solitons, are similar to the ideas proposed by Dr. Miguel Alcubierre, but Dr. Lentz's discovery is the first known solution of its kind. He published his findings in the journal Classical and Quantum Gravity and showed that these bubbles can be created using plasma, a type of gas with positive and negative charges. These findings offer a potential solution for warping space-time and achieving faster-than-light travel. Is the speed of light affected by the presence of a vacuum? The speed of light is a constant that is the same in all inertial frames of reference, and it is the highest speed at which energy, matter, and information can travel. In a vacuum, the speed of light is approximately 299,792 kilometers per second, or 186,282 miles per second. According to the theory of special relativity, nothing can travel faster than the speed of light in a vacuum. However, in a non-vacuum environment, such as through a medium like glass or water, the different frequencies or hues of light may travel at different speeds. This is known as the wave-particle duality of light. In these cases, some waves may travel more quickly than white or colorless light. However, light itself will never travel faster than the speed of light in a vacuum, regardless of the medium. Particles found to travel faster than the speed of light Evidence from the OPERA experiment in Italy's Gran Sasso National Laboratory suggests that fundamental particles known as neutrinos may be able to travel faster than the speed of light, challenging the most fundamental principle of contemporary physics. Neutrinos, which have an extremely low mass, are electrically neutral and rarely interact with other types of matter, but are produced in large quantities by nuclear events and are constantly present around us. The OPERA experiment, which is located 1400 meters below the Earth's surface and is designed to investigate a neutrino beam originating from CERN, the top high-energy physics research facility in Europe, observed that the neutrinos were arriving 60 nanoseconds quicker than the speed of light would allow. 
The 1800-ton Opera Detector is a complex system consisting of electronics and photographic emulsion plates, and the finding has left the researchers, including Antonio Arrediato, a physicist at the University of Bern in Switzerland, and a representative for Opera, stunned. However, it is important to note that this finding has not yet been independently verified, and other experts are cautioning against jumping to conclusions until further experiments can be conducted to confirm or refute the result. If the finding is eventually confirmed, it would have significant implications for our understanding of the universe and the fundamental laws of physics. Breaking the law. If the recent finding by the OPERA experiment in Italy that neutrinos may be able to travel faster than the speed of light is confirmed, it would have significant implications for our understanding of the universe and the fundamental laws of physics. This finding would challenge the fundamental principle of modern physics, which states that nothing can move faster than light in a vacuum as well as the assumption that the laws of physics are the same for all observers. The discovery has been observed in more than 16,000 instances over the past two years and has a six sigma significance, indicating that it is highly likely to be true. Similar results have been observed in at least one other experiment, though with lower confidence. The Minos experiment in Minnesota has also observed neutrinos arriving slightly early from the Illinois Particle Physics Facility, Fermilab but the uncertain location of the detector has caused the team to downplay the discovery. However, they are now preparing more precise follow-up studies with the hope of making a measurement within the next year or two. If the OPERA finding is eventually confirmed, it would have major implications for our understanding of the universe and the fundamental laws that govern it. The discovery could potentially open up new avenues of research and lead to the development of new technologies and advancements in the field of physics. It would also force a re-evaluation of our current understanding of the limitations of the laws of physics and potentially lead to the development of new theories or modifications to existing ones. Does this prove Einstein wrong? Einstein's theory of special relativity does not actually state that nothing can move at or faster than the speed of light. Instead, it states that the maximum speed limit of 300,000 kph only holds true if space and time are not altered in any way. If it were possible to bend space-time around a spacecraft, there would be no upper limit to how quickly we could travel around the galaxy, according to Einstein's equations. While the idea of breaking the speed of light has long been considered a fantasy, recent discoveries in the field of physics have led some to question whether this seemingly unbreakable speed limit might not be as absolute as previously thought. The Impact and Future Potential of the Discovery the potential impact of this mind-blowing breakthrough on fields such as astrophysics, astronomy, and space exploration is practically limitless. With the ability to travel faster than the speed of light, scientists could potentially study distant parts of the universe that were previously inaccessible. This could lead to the discovery of new galaxies, planets, and even extraterrestrial life forms. In addition, the ability to travel at faster than light speeds could revolutionize space exploration and allow humans to colonize other planets and celestial bodies more efficiently. The future potential of this method is equally exciting. By unlocking the possibility of travel at speeds faster than light, scientists may be able to make further groundbreaking discoveries that were previously unimaginable. This could lead to a whole new era of scientific exploration and understanding of the universe. It is impossible to predict exactly what doors this new method will open, but one thing is certain. It has the potential to fundamentally change the way we think about and interact with the universe. So what are your thoughts on light speed traveling? Let us know in the comments below. Space Infinity will continue to deliver the latest news on the vast oceans of space and all its new discoveries. So tap that like button and subscribe. We'll see you in the next one.